My name is Pia, I'm from Berlin. And when I came here to Geraldton, I was fascinated about the Aboriginal languages. I worked at the Western Australian Museum and they had an exhibition there uh, about the body Maya language. I went to lectures and I started to do a Wajiri language course. What I found really interesting that Wajiri is the most commonly spoken uh, language in, in the area around Geraldton but there are only not more than f about 50 fluent speakers remaining, which I found really uh, yeah, sad and astonishing. And then I carried out, when I was back in Berlin, the idea to smuggle in the language, Wajiri, in the public space of Geraldton. First of all, I met uh, last year Aboriginal elders and talked with them about my idea, in general, to work about Wajiri language. And yeah, they, I was happy that they appreciated it. And when I came back this year, I tried as hard as I could to get hold of uh, a Wajiri elders. I went to country because it's also very important to get to know country here. The Wajiri Yamachi country, I met an elder there and I met several elders who come to town during my stay. And yeah, I have to say after they get first, maybe they were skeptical when they just heard about it. But when I was talking to them, fortunately they all appreciated it a lot. I think it was really interesting when I first read about her project and she was coming all the way from Berlin to introduce Wajiri language to us that live here in Geraldton. I found that quite fascinating. I think the important thing with this project was that the community took it on and obviously when you're working with Aboriginal people there's a lot of consultation that has to take place and it can be um, quite a complex process. There's a lot of protocols to understand and I feel that um, the support from both the Aboriginal community and also the more broader community has been very positive. I wanted to find a way to smuggle the, word, the language in the public space of Geraldton and I was thinking about it and I thought t-shirts is a pretty good idea because the weather is nice, you don't need here to wear three pullovers over the t-shirt like you would do in Berlin at that time of the year. So um, um, you can make your word public and when people meet each other with the t-shirt they can look at each other they can turn around so this is Wajigada and if I turn around you see all of us are all together and for me this word was important to, t to adopt for myself because it means the whole population of Geraldton or at least the ones who adopt the word should um, take care to keep the language alive so that it doesn't die out. Yeah. I think, it's, I think it is creative and, and exciting that people can wear a shirt or learn one word and be the carrier or the mentor of that word and share it with other people that they know. So in a way the, the people of Geraldton are a living archive for the language and even if no one of them speak the word, uh, the language fluently, at least everybody knows a word. So in a whole we speak the language of Wajiri.